Indian Accounting Standard 2 Inventories prescribes the accounting treatment for inventories such as determination of cost and its subsequent recognition as expense including any write downs of inventories to net realizable value and reversal of write downs in this audio we shall learn about the basics of AS2 let us first understand the scope of AS2 AS2 applies to all inventories except a financial instruments and b biological assets related to agriculture in addition it may also be noted that this standard does not apply to the measurement of inventories held by the following a producers of agricultural and forest products agricultural produce after harvest and minerals and mineral products to the extent they are measured at net realizable value b commodity broker trader who measure their inventories at fair value after deducting cost to sell the inventory the ground rule of measuring inventories is that the inventories shall be measured at the lower of a cost and b net realizable value in the next few minutes let us understand how to arrive at the cost of inventories and net realizable value of inventory cost of inventories is equal to all cost of purchase plus cost of conversion plus other cost incurred in bringing the inventories to its current location and condition on the other hand net realizable value is equal to the estimated selling price in the ordinary course of business minus the estimated cost of completion and the estimated cost necessary to make the sale now let us explore the methodology of computing the cost of purchase as per as2 cost of purchase is equal to purchase price plus import duties plus taxes plus transportation plus handling cost plus any other direct cost minus trade discounts minus rebates minus any other direct deductions from purchase price moving on cost of conversion is equal to cost directly related to the units of production such as direct labor plus systematic allocation of fixed and variable production overheads that are incurred in converting materials into finished goods other cost are the cost incurred in bringing the inventories to the present location and condition like cost of designing products for specific customers an entity shall ascertain the cost of inventories by applying proper technique and cost formula if an inventory item is unique to the particular project then the same needs to be identified individually and the cost needs to be assigned for the cost of inventories other than above first in first out fifo or weighted average cost formula can be applied care must be taken to ensure that the entity shall use the same cost formula for all inventories having a similar nature and use as discussed earlier net realizable value is the estimated selling price in the ordinary course of business less the estimated cost of completion and the estimated cost necessary to make the sale the practice of writing inventories down below cost to net realizable value is consistent with the view that assets should not be carried in excess of amount expected to be realized from their sale or use estimates of net realizable value are based on the most reliable evidence available at the time the estimates are made recognition as an expense when inventories are sold the carrying amount of inventories shall be recognized as an expense in the period in which the related revenue is recognized the amount of any write down to net realizable value and all losses of inventories shall be recognized as an expense in the period in which the write downs or loss occurs the amount of any reversal or any write downs of inventories arising from an increase in the net realizable value shall be recognized as a reduction in the amount of inventories recognized as an expenses in the period in which the reversal occurs